Teacher Shell Learning Resource Channel. Let's read a short story with comprehension check. The Wise Mice An old cat wanted to catch all the mice in the barn. One day, the mice met to talk about the great harm that cat was doing to them. Each mouse tried to think of a plan by which to keep out of the cat's way. Do as I say, said an old gray mouse that was thought to be very wise. Do as I say, hang a bell on the cat's neck. Then, when we hear it ring, we will know that she is coming and can scamper out of her way. Good, good, said all the other mice as one run to get the bell. Now, which of you will hang this bell on the cat's neck? said the old gray mouse. Not I, not I, said all the mice together. And they scampered away to their holes. Your turn to read, kids. Good job! This time, let's answer the questions from the story. Number 1. What did the old cat want to do? A. Catch all the birds in the barn. B. Catch all the bags in the barn. C. Catch all the mice in the barn. You're right. The correct answer is... Letter A. C. Catch all the mice in the barn. Number two, 
Why did the mice meet one day? A. To discuss the harm the cat was doing to them. B. To plan a party. C. To look for food. You're right, the correct answer is Letter A, to discuss the harm the cat was doing to them. Number 3, what was the goal of the mice meeting? A, to think of a plan to keep out of the cat's way. B, to elect a new leader. C. To decide where to build a new home. You're right. The correct answer is letter A. To think of a plan to keep out of the cat's way. Number four. What was the old gray mouse thought to be? A. Very fast. B. Very strong. C. Very wise. You're right. The correct answer is... Letter C, very wise. Number 5. Who suggested a plan to hang a bell on the cat's neck? A. A young mouse. B. An old gray mouse. C. A brown mouse. You're right, the correct answer is letter B, an old gray mouse. Number 6. What was the purpose of hanging a bell on the cat's neck? A. To decorate the cat. B. To know when the cat was coming. C. To make the cat run away. You're right, the correct answer is letter B, to know when the cat was coming. Number 7. How did the other mice react to the plan of hanging a bell on the cat's neck? A. They all agreed it was a good plan. B. They laughed at the idea. C. They ignored the suggestion. You're right. The correct answer is... Letter A. They all agreed it was a good plan. Number 8. What did the mice say when asked who would hang the bell on the cat's neck? A. I will do it. B. Not me, not me. C. We will all do it together. You're right. The correct answer is letter B. Not me, not me. Number 9. What happened after the mice were asked to hang the bell on the cat's neck? 
A. They bravely went to the cut. B. They scampered away to their holes. C. They hung the bell on the cat's neck. You're right, the correct answer is letter B. They scampered away to their holes. Number 10. What is the main lesson of the story? Letter A. It is easy to propose impossible plans. B. Cats and mice can never be friends. C. Bells are useful for warning signals. You're right, the correct answer is Letter A, it is easy to propose impossible plans. How many scores did you get? Wow, that's a good job! Do not forget to hit the like and subscribe button to be notified on our next episodes. Goodbye, kids!